what's up guys welcome to my vlog and if you are new to my channel please consider subscribing it i have a joke for you today billionaires are too scared to go out on street without bodyguards why because there are too many millionaires on the street all right that was a bad joke but if you look at it in the context of a country called monaco it will make sense because one out of every three resident in monaco is a millionaire. Monaco is the second smallest country in the world after Vatican. This premier luxury destination is located in Western Europe along the coast of Mediterranean Sea and it is home for many rich and famous people like Lewis Hamilton, Boris Becker, Novak Djokovic, Bono from YouTube. And now you'll ask me why is it so? And the reason is Monaco has no income tax, no property tax, no capital gain tax. Basically, it's a tax haven and now you know where all these celebrities park their money to avoid income tax in their own country. Monaco is known for two more things. Casino Royale, but I am not into gambling. Second is Monaco Grand Prix. Monaco Grand Prix is the most prestigious automobile race in the world. This Formula 1 race takes place on the charismatic street of the Monte Carlo where on one side you have high-rise apartment complex and on the other side it has a marina where all the millionaire and billionaire park their yacht. Even Vijay was known for his yacht party in Monaco before he went bankrupt. Monaco Grand Prix is really high up there in my to-do bucket list. Maybe one day I'll make vlog from there, but that day is not today. In this vlog, I may not be able to take you to Monaco Grand Prix, but I'll make you experience little flavor of it. Because today, in St. Pete downtown, we have an IndyCar racing event. IndyCar racing series is similar to Formula 1, without going much into details in car and technical regulation, I'll just highlight that. Probably the IndyCar racing team annual budget would be around 15 million, whereas in Formula 1, the average team budget would be 150 million. I think it will give you enough idea about the difference between IndyCar and Formula 1. Talking about today's race event, it's more or less similar to the Monaco Grand Prix. It is a street circuit. It has marina on, on one side where all the rich people park their fancy yacht. On other side, it has high-rise apartment building. But the best part is, I have a friend who have an apartment in one of those buildings, and I will get to watch the race from there without paying anything for the ticket. That's the best part of this race. Are you guys ready for it? Let's go. St. Pete downtown now, walking to my friend's place. I'm so looking forward to this race event. Behind me is the entrance of the section and that's the ticket counter over there but we don't buy ticket and we'll have a better view than this follow me
was an awesome party and that was a nice get together and now I need to head back to home because I am very tired. I haven't slept much last night so I need to take rest. So that was my Sunday and I think it was very well spent. I like the weekends where I don't spend too much money. On that note, I'll end this vlog. See you next time.